365 Being Eyelid actor Michele Moroni confirms that the film will return for a sequel. Michele Moroni, in a recent interview with a fan, confirmed that he will return for a sequel of the hit 365 BNI. In this time of lockdown, OTT platforms have become one of the major sources of the entertainment for people. Several OTT platforms have been releasing new content for their users. Some time ago, Netflix also released an erotic romance drama film titled 365 BNI. This movie has been loved by fans and has been in the top 10 of Netflix list for quite a long time. Recently, actor Michele Moroni confirmed that he will be seen reprising his role in the sequel to Netflix erotic thriller 365 DNI. The 29-year-old actor Michele Moroni plays the role of mafia boss Massimo from the Torricelli family. In the film, he is seen kidnapping the lead actor Laura played by Ana Maria Cicluca and the duo's chemistry was loved by fans. This film is based on the first novel in a series of three books and fans have been expecting to see the sequel films to the hit release. Here is what he had to say about him working in the sequel of 365 DNI. The Italian actor talked to a fan on an online platform during which he confirmed that there will be a sequel to the erotic romance drama and it will be involving him. This clip was then got by a media house in which he ex expressed that the makers of 365 DNI and he are going to start shooting the second part of the film. The actor then added that due to the ongoing pandemic situation, the film's sequel will be delayed. He also mentioned that there is no fixed date set for the release of the film, but one thing is for sure that the film will be made. What to expect in a 365 DNI sequel? The end of the film leaves fans in a cliffhanger whether Massimo's Lady Love comes out of the tunnel or not. In the second 365 DNI book, the story picks up from the point that reveals that the lead's whole family has been abducted by the rival family. The sequel of the film might show how Massimo gets Laura to safety by doing his best. Other than this, it is also reported that the second part of the book might show Massimo and Laura getting married. Furthermore, in the third novel shows Laura getting pregnant with Massimo's child. The book then takes a dark turn as Laura is shot and he, Massimo, has to decide between saving the baby or saving his lady love. It can only be speculated whether the makers of the film decide to make the films along the same lines as the novels. There also is a possibility that the last two novels might be merged into one and a film will be made accordingly.